Charting your family tree has never been easier in recent years with at-home DNA testing, and now dog owners can use that same technology to find out what breed their four-legged family members are. Taking action for you, we put them to the test to see if those over-the-counter dog DNA kits are really worth your money. Jump. Jump. Six years ago, Mike Hammonds... He will not leave my side. ...found a new best friend, a rescue dog he named Stoli. Question I get asked all the time is like, how, what kind of dog is it? Stoli came home with a lot of love, but also lots of questions as to what kind of breeds were under that wiry coat. Like a Wheaton Terrier, or, I, I know it's some kind of Terrier he has in him. An American Bulldog, I was told. He has a, a personality of a human. I mean, he's like this close to talking. But until mixed breeds like Stoli can talk and tell us what they are, dog owners are finding out their canine's backstory with these. Dog DNA test kits you can do at home. We tested two of the most popular brands on Stoli, Wisdom Panel, and DNA My Dog. For $70 to $80, you swab the inside of your dog's cheek and send it off to a lab. How accurate are they? We went to visit Brooks, purebred. We know who his mother is, who his father is. 100% whip it, an American Kennel Club certified. 18, 19, 20. If the doggy DNA test could guess Brooks's bloodline correctly from a cheek swab, we knew there was at least some accuracy to these at-home tests. Three weeks later, both tests came back 100% whip it. Now the moment of truth for Stoli. Where does that thick, wiry coat come from? 25% <gasps> poodle. 25% American Bulldog. Those results coming from Wisdom Panel, who says they use a DNA screen from more than 250 breeds. Hammond's shocked to find no terrier in Stoli, but this bombshell. 12 and a half French Bulldog, 12 and a half Chinese Sharpe. The other test, DNA My Dog, agreed with one thing. Wow. <laughs> 37 to 74% poodle. After that, both tests did not agree on anything. And a Pomeranian, <laughs> one to 9%. Not surprising, says veterinarian Rhonda Johnson. If your dog is a highly mixed breed with a lot of different minority breeds in it, I think that you're probably gonna be looking at it for fun. If only Stoli could have talked from the start. You're a poodle now. Well, this test can range from $60 to $200, and for that high-end range, vets suggest doing a blood test in their office that can also detect genetic issues that could spring up down the road for your dog.